Hey everyone, Pastor Matty Montgomery here. And uh, you know, over these last few months, we have been just marveling at the faithfulness of God that he's demonstrated. As we launched this church uh, to the public just over two and a half years ago, we came to the area about three years ago and um, immediately after arriving here, people started uprooting their lives to relocate here. Uh, we launched the church in January of 2020. And since that time, we've seen thousands of people come through our doors marriages healed, people born again, set free from uh, addiction, depression, suicide, and lives just utterly transformed in, in countless ways by the power and the presence of God and the message of his kingdom. And, uh, you know, as, as the Lord has continued to, to bring increase to this house, it has become evident that the building we are in, as grateful as we are for it, would not be a, a long-term solution for us. It wouldn't be uh, the forever home for this family that God has called us here to build in Johnson City. Just a few months ago, as I was boarding a plane out to Las Vegas for our, um, our national conference, the Lord began to speak to me. He said, Maddie, you need to look at, at, at commercial real estate right now. And so I I'd sit down on the plane and I open my laptop and I begin looking furiously through the listings. And for the first time in three years since we'd moved to this area, there was a church for sale in Johnson City a beautiful 18,000 square foot building on three and a half acres with 220 parking spots with classrooms and offices and more than enough room to house our growing family. We put in an offer, the offer was accepted and on July 15th, we are gonna be closing on this incredible building here in Johnson City that I believe is going to be the, the home for the Altar Fellowship for many years to come. Uh, and I expect that this building we're coming into, that this building is going to uh, be the, the, the backdrop for some of the most significant moments of our lives. It'll be the place that our children receive Jesus as, as their Lord and Savior. It'll be the place that we see new believers baptized into the family of God. It'll be the place that some of you get married or that some of your marriages are restored. This is going to be the place that uh, uh, the next generation of dynamic kingdom leaders are raised up and sent out with the message of home. For those of you that are a part of the community, and those of you that maybe are an, an extended part of our community from other parts of the nation or the world, I want to give you the opportunity to join with what we are calling the Homestead Project. And that is our attempt to fund the acquisition of this building. Now, uh, this building is a, it's a, a $1 million commitment of, of faith for us. If you've been blessed by this ministry, if you would call the Altar Fellowship your home, Maybe you're not able to be here in Johnson City all the time, and, and so you'd call this your, your home away from home. You listen to the podcast. If you receive from this ministry, even if you are a part of the, the conference that we put on in Las Vegas, I would invite you to prayerfully consider what it might look like for you to contribute to the Homestead Project, to become a partner of the Altar Fellowship, to, to have a seat at the table, and, and to, to help make it possible for us to come into uh, this new facility that God has made available to us debt-free. That's the dream. We want to see over the next two years, over the next 24 months from, from, this, from this month now, we'd like to see this building, all $1 million of it, entirely paid off to the glory of God so that the funds of this church and the regular giving of this church can go to um, the establishment and the advancement of the kingdom in our city, in our nation, and in our generation. So as you prayerfully consider what it might look like for you to partner with the Altar Fellowship in our Homestead Project, I want you to remember this. This is only the beginning. Because of you and others like you, we know that the best is yet to come. Thank you. God bless you. And we hope to see you here in Johnson City very soon.